Inside India's Underwater Bullet Train Have you ever visited India? If you ever visit India, what will be the most exciting place that you would love to experience? In case you don't know what exactly to expect from India, then this video is for you. I urge you to watch this video till the end, so you will see the experience the exception bullet train that India has, and when you eventually visit India you will most likely want to take a ride in it. But before we take a dive into this video, make sure that you like it, subscribe to this channel, and hit the notification bell that that you will be informed whenever we upload a new video. It was discovered that about 23 million people use trains transportation system in India on a daily basis as of 2016. This figure has over time increased significantly that there is need to develop a more sophisticated train system that will cater for this growing population. This led to the birth of the underwater bullet trains. In India, the construction of a proposed billion-dollar 508 km bullet trains rail track began in 2015. This track would cover a distance of 16 miles linking popular cities like Mumbai and Amadab. The previous train system took eight hours to cover this journey, but this bullet trains will complete this journey in the twinkle of an eye, around two or three hours. This train system will feature a 13-mile long, 21 kilometers, underwater tunnel, which will cut across the sea, specifically between Vane Creek and Vaya. This massive scientifically and technological innovation will be worth $14.6 billion for its construction. Japanese International Cooperation Agency, JICA, willingly loaned $8.1 billion for this project, with a flexible 10 years payback plan of $908 million, 100 billion yen, annually. This project will be designed to be eco-friendly with solar panels support systems as well as water treatment technology. The train will feature adequate ventilation and natural lightning interior. This bullet train will travel fast at about 3,320 km per hour, 129 miles slash h, therefore reducing passengers traveling time by a significant amount. The first 18 E5 series series bullet train was sent from Japan to India in 2019, and it collectively cost $964 million. On the other hand, the track construction is expected to be completely in 2023, but certain challenges began to hinder its completion. One criterion for its completion was that it will first obtain 80% of the land needed to complete this project according to the National High Speed Rail Cooperation Limited NHSRCL, but as of 2021, it has only acquired 23% of this land. In order to meet this requirement, the completion date has been shifted to 2028. Another challenge was the inability to connect the cities of Kolkata and Hara efficiently. The bridge that connected these cities took hours to go through, and using ferries to cross over the river take 20 minutes, so they concluded that they will construct a 10.8 km 6.7 miles underground east-west metro track, while the track under the river will amount to 520 meters, 1,706 feet, making the distance between these two cities to be two minutes. This made history for India, as it became the first underwater project. The underwater rail track lied 30 meters slash 98 feet. Under the seabed, this train tunnel will be supported and strengthened with solid concrete containing fly ash and microsilicon, thus providing support from the river and complete sealing from leakage. But during the construction of the underground and underwater project, the engineers encountered challenges, one of which is the COVID-19 pandemic, another occurred in August 2019 when one of the boring machine met an obstacle along its path and got to destroyed, and it affected the foundations of lot of building around, and even led to collapse of some of such buildings in these cities and these areas has to be evacuated. Work resumed with full force on the tunnel in February 2020, this particular portion of the project will be functional and up and running March 2022, and there is an expectation that this rail line will convene 1 million passengers daily by 2035, this particular portion will cost $1.17 billion, JICA will provide also provide a soft loan of 500 $160 million to enforce the railway track with adequate lightning systems. All these is just a tip of the iceberg as India have taken a step further with a proposal to make an underground suspended and floating railway tunnel from India, Mumbai, to the United States Emirate, Fujaira. This tunnel will cover a distance of 1826 km 1135 miles. From Mumbai to Fujaira using a combined transportation of flight slash plane and bus slash road will be about 9 hours, but such underground rail system will only be done in just four hours. It is even confirmed by the UA 
UAE authority that it will cover 1,000 km per hour reducing the traveling time to lesser hours probably 2 or 3 hours, a vacuum will help this speed to be achievable. This project was proposed when the managing director, chief consultant and founder of National Advisory Bureau Limited, Abdullah Ad Shiaikh IH attended a UAE India conclave in Abu Dhabi in 2018 and brought the idea. This project will also go through cities in Pakistan. This tunnel will cut across water and oil pipelines and will be basically to promote trade and carry goods from one country to the other, though it will also convene passengers. India purchased 1 million barrel of crude oil from UAE, which cost $32 million in April 2020. UAE received 35,510 liters of water from India in 2019 and 2020. This train will make this trade faster and more efficient. Similarly Norway proposed constructed a train tunnel across rocks, road, water and bridge from at northern Trondheim to southern state, covering 21 hours previously and seven trips on ferries. This tunnel will reduce the journey time to 10 hours traveling a distance of 1100 km 684 miles costing 40 billion dollars. If you enjoyed this video, like it, subscribe to this channel, and hit the notification bells so that you will be informed each time we release a new video. You can leave a comment too. Thank for you watching.